Hi boys and girls in fourth grade, here's the solution for today's problem of the day. So for today's problem, it says in the subtraction problem below, find the digit represented by B. Each time B appears, it represents the same digit. So I have B minus B is zero. Well, yeah, anytime you subtract a number from itself, you're gonna get the number zero. So how do we know what B is gonna be? I'm gonna use the guess and check strategy. Okay, so let's say, and I'm gonna switch to a different color. <clears throat> let's say B is one. One minus one would give me zero. But is one minus eight gonna be one? That doesn't seem to work. I'm gonna have to go over to the hundreds column, cross off a two and make it a one, which makes this now an 11. 11 minus eight is not gonna be one. 11 minus eight would be three. So that would mean that B would have to be three in both of these places as well. So let's see, three minus three is zero. One minus eight, again, I can't do, crossed out the two, made it a one, this becomes 11. 11 minus eight is three. One minus zero is one. So B is going to be three. And that is my final answer. See you tomorrow.